For the next part of our presentation, we're going to be going over university life. So this entails a day in the life of studying in Berlin at CIE. Today is Monday, November 28th, 1753. Or, or 553. Or American time. Depending on um, your preference. And we're working on this presentation. And this is something we would be doing down here in the, the lobby. CIE lobby. This is a day in the life. Yeah. An hour from now at 19 o'clock or 7 o'clock, I'm meeting right back here in this lobby for a tour of the Reichstag building or the German parliament building. This is one of the pros of studying abroad. I get to see so many new things and I get to experience so many different cultures, such as the culture in Berlin, and learn about German government in classes such as politics of the EU and an excursion such as this tour of the Reichstag building. These are experiences I never would have had if I didn't do a study abroad and if CIE and North Northeastern didn't organize programs like this for me to do. So I'm really excited to do that and I'll show you guys the tour when I'm there. Another aspect of university life is the fact that now um, I have to cook my own food and rely on myself for food. So here I have my bag and I'm heading over to the communal kitchen to make myself some dinner. Um, I'm gonna make some pasta and vegetables that I bought from the market. And this is a huge pro, I think, of studying abroad in Germany because we have our own communal kitchens rather than in Boston. We're probably not gonna have kitchens to cook in all the time. So now we're in the fourth floor kitchen, all making dinner. We have this Reichstag tour in 30 minutes and some students have the Pollock to the EU lecture in about an hour. I have George and Mallory here with me, fellow Pollock to the EU students. Over here we have Nandini and Irina, some more Pollock to the EU students. Update on my dinner, another pro of studying abroad in Berlin is that we have our own kitchens to cook in. Like I showed before, we have this awesome kitchen which also serves as a nice place to catch up with your friends while having a nice meal and cooking dinner. We are currently in the Meddingdam station going to the Reichstag tour um, with Ari, fellow group member. And here we have more CIE kids including Eddie and George. Oh, just let me zoom in. Transition followed at Reichstag tour. Three, right. two, one. <laughs> Walking in the Reichstag right now with George and Albert and Ari on the end. And a lot of other people. And a lot of other people. We're getting a guided tour of the building. Um, Professor Welt, you would love this. All right, can you explain where we are right now? We're at the Reichstag. This is the dome. Welcome to Germany. Look at this. The German flag over here. Reichstag <laughs> over here. Beautiful architecture. Little view down over here. Another group member, George, right look here. Look at this. Look at this. Look at, look at this spiral over here. Spiral. spiral. And then guess, guess what's underneath. Guess what's underneath us? Guess what? Where they all sit. Where they all sit. The congregate. George, where are we right now? We this is this is what it's all about right here. This politics of the politics European of the Union. EU. Where do the politics of the EU happen? The right side. Partially here. The right side. Okay. Partially here. At least the German part of it. This is We're what it's all about. On top of Shout the out right Reichstag side. building. Check out this architecture. EU. <laughs> What's up, vlog? We're on top of the Reichstag building right now. Do, do a little 360. See, we're on top of the world. Look at this. If you out the window, crazy. We're so high up right now. Merry Christmas from the Brandenburg Gate. Look at this. Whole view of under right, checking back at 11.25 p.m. Working on a project for global learning experiences, a virtual class that's one credit and taking place back in Boston. Okay. With some of my group members, this is a pretty typical um, Monday night for me, usually doing schoolwork. And I'm gonna head to bed soon, just had some dinner. Great night. All right, and for the last clip of the day, it's just past midnight, but I had to bed. I have class at 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, so I'll give you guys an update then.
But for now, I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far. What's up vlog? Just got out of the elevator. I'm on my way to Holocaust Studies, my first class of the day. Um, I woke up kind of late, so I didn't really get to do a morning vlog. But in reality, I really just rolled out of bed, uh, put the first thing I saw on and brushed my teeth. So I just finished my morning class and I came up and now we're working on our politics and EU presentation with the whole group. Everyone say hi. Hi. Okay. We're coming back from Etika, the nearby supermarket. Back. Um, this is the biggest the nearby supermarket, the CIE, and it's a common place for all the students to go to get their daily groceries. I just got news that my 6.30 class was canceled, meaning I only had one class today rather than two. So I just got back from Etika, stopped by a room real quick, dropped everything off, and um, I was talking to my dad on the phone in the fourth floor lounge right back there. Um, now I'm headed over to the gym, but before that, I'll give you guys a quick tour of the laundry room. Um, I'm just going to check my laundry and see what's done and move into the dryer before I head over to the gym. Little vlog in the gym, uh, doing chess today. I feel kind of weird recording in here, but might as well. Here's a little tour of American Fitness, which is ironic, we're in Germany, but go to a gym called American Fitness. Um, my membership expires tomorrow, so tomorrow's my last gym day, but I take it on today. What's up vlog? So I'm back from the gym. I just picked up my laundry, I washed my sheets. Um, I just had a quick bite to eat. I was eating yesterday's leftovers. And now I'm heading back to my room. Uh, I'm gonna do some calc homework and play some guitar and I'll keep you guys updated. What's up vlog? I'm in the fifth floor lounge now. I'm doing calc homework with a side of World Cup or we could say World Cup with a side of calc homework. Um, That's so funny. That's very funny. I, I love to spend my time here in Europe watching the World Cup at local times because it's centered toward European times, which is another pro of being in Europe. I can watch soccer really well. But a con, on the contrary, is that American sports often happen really late at night, so I have a hard time watching American sports. <laughs> Scenes of the Calc Project, Tobin Project. I finished all my work for the day, so now I'm going over to the fourth floor kitchen. Make myself some dinner. Uh, it's a pretty bad angle, but um, yeah, I'm making some salmon, rice, spinach, mushrooms, and garlic. Uh, so it should be a nice hearty dinner. I like to cook every day and I really like to eat my own food. I think it tastes better than some of my food. <laughs> What's up guys, just checking back in. I just finished having dinner. Now I'm having some chocolate pudding and watching the World Cup before I get ready for bed. Um, when I'm done, I'll probably play some guitar for a little while because my roommate's not here. So you both monks open so I can make some noise and play some guitar. Um, and then probably head to bed because it's, it's 9 p.m. Um, game will probably end around 10, guitar for around half an hour. And hang to bed hopefully before 11 and then I just gotta edit this video which should not take too long. But um, yeah, I'm glad you guys follow me around my day. And I guess I'll have a few more clips left. Hope you're enjoying. So vlog, USA game just ended. Guess who's advancing to the round of 16 in the World Cup? Yeah. We are. Let's go, America. What's up, vlogs? I'm sitting at bed right now. Just put my guitar back in the case. Um, played for about 20 minutes. It's around 11 o'clock now. Um, I'm going to head to bed. So I think this will be the last clip of the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I hope I can take you. I hope um, I did a good job of taking you guys through what a typical day in life is for me. Um, studying in Berlin. While the Reich strike totally happened last night, obviously, it's something that happens every day. I feel like here in Germany, um, Northeastern and CAE have been doing a great job of keeping great job of keeping us engaged and always giving us new excursions to do and new ways to see the city. So while I might not see the Reichstag building every day, I feel like a few times a week I'm always doing something unique to Berlin. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.